Hi guys, welcome to Airdrop Spot and welcome to today's tutorial. So the first thing we want to do is we want to get some Sepolia, scroll Sepolia testnet tokens. But before we do that, we'll visit sepoliafaucet.com to get some Sepolia ETH. So you paste in your wallet address. Next, you are going to complete the capture at the bottom of the screen and then you tap on send me ETH button. It doesn't take too long for your Sepolia ETH to arrive in your wallet. So now what we need to do next is we want to bridge that Sepolia ETH into scroll Sepolia. So you are going to visit scroll.io slash bridge. I'm going to leave every link that I use in this video in the comment section for your convenience. So you are going to connect your wallet if it is not yet connected and then you are going to be on that deposit to scroll tab. And if you look at the bottom of my screen, it is telling me I need to be on the Ethereum Sepolia because that is where I want to send from. So I'm going to go into my wallet now and then I'll switch my wallet to Ethereum Sepolia. So I'll choose Sepolia and I am now on the Sepolia network. So next I'll go back to the bridging website. And then you are going to make sure that your sending address is Ethereum Sepolia and your receiving, uh, sorry, your sending network is Ethereum Sepolia and receiving network is Scroll Sepolia. So you are going to enter the amount of Ethereum Sepolia that you want to bridge into Scroll. I enter 0.02 and then you are going to tap on deposit funds. Then you are going to confirm the transaction in your wallet. So the transaction has been sent to the blockchain and as you can see here it may take up to 20 minutes before your scroll sepolia will arrive in your wallet. So once your scroll sepolia arrives in your wallet we are going to move on to the next step. So you are going to visit scroll ns, scroll ns .com. What we want to do here is we want to register a domain name on scroll. Domain name is like your username on your social media. If somebody wants to message you all they need to do is type in your username on the search bar of that social media and your handle is going to pop up and then they can message you. So with domain name, you can actually receive money instead of copying that your long wallet address in your wallet. You can simply give people your domain name and then they are going to send you funds and you can also send funds through domain name. So uh, many blockchains have their own domain name registration. Ethereum have and the domain name will end in .eth. BNB2 have, it will end in .scroll and for scroll uh, sorry bnb hub it will end in dot bnb and for scroll it is going to end in dot scroll so you are going to connect your wallet choose metamask tap on next and tap on connect and you are also going to make sure that you are now on the scroll sepolia network you know we switched to ethereum sepolia earlier now you need to be on the scroll sepolia then this is the search bar where you are going to type in your your preferred username that you want to be bearing on the blockchain but if you are on mobile view it won't work so you need to switch to desktop mode and now if i tap on that search bar again you are going to see that it is now active so i'm going to type in the uh, username i want my wallet address to be bearing on the blockchain and then you are going to tap on search to confirm if that username has not been taken by someone else. So the username is available. Then you are going to tap on that username again. You can see that it ends with a dot .scroll extension. So you are going to indicate the number of period that you want to register the username for. One period means one year. So if you enter more than one year, that's the number of years that you want to register for and then you are going to tap on register with ethereum so you're going to tap on confirm and then you are going to wait for the registration to be successful So the registration is successful the next thing you want to do is you are going to switch to the my profile tab at the top of the screen 
and then you are going to see this white box at the middle of your screen then tap on that drop down arrow and then your username that you just registered will pop up then tap on save the essence of doing this is so that you can start receiving notifications whenever you use your username to send or receive funds just like you receive notification from your wallet in metamask So after saving your username, the next thing we are going to do is we are going to visit Gals and we are going to claim out for registering our domain on testnet. Remember that everything you just did is on testnet. When the mainnet launch, then you can also you know, register your domain on mainnet and start receiving funds with your username on mainnet. But whatever you've done on testnet remains on testnet. So the first task on, on Gals is for us to follow their Twitter account. We want to follow scrollerness domain on twitter so we're going to tap on twitter i'm going to hit the follow button i'll go back to girls and i'll confirm if the follow is successful the next task is to follow star protocol on twitter those are the developers of uh, scrollerness domain name i'll tap on follow i'll go back to girls so it wasn't successful, I will try again later. So the top task is to visit the scrollns.com that where we just registered the domain name now. Even though we've been there before, you just have to tap on it again so that it can't count. So after visiting the website, go back. Then I'll tap on that refresh arrow successful then the next thing is to like a post on twitter i'll tap the like button and return to girls i'll tap on the refresh button to confirm it wasn't successful so i'll try again then the last one is to retweet a post on twitter and then you are required to tag three people on Twitter. So you can tag your friends, you can tag people you are following, people you are not following, or simply tag your village people as well. <laughs> so I did the liking task earlier that wasn't successful. I did it again this time. So you are going to refresh to confirm if it is successful. So this is the last one where you are supposed to post, retweet a post and then tag three friends. So once you have done that, you will return to girls. I will refresh the two tasks now. Okay, so I have completed everything and then you can see the button at the bottom of the screen is now active. I am required to switch to Optimism Network. So I will tap on the button. I'll go into my MetaMask and I'll switch the network to Optimism Network. Then I'll return to Gals to claim the oath. Now you can see claim oath and 35 points, so I'm going to tap on it. Then you confirm that in your wallet. It requires a gas fee of about two cents this is two cents and i actually have three cents on my wallet so i think it should go through then you tap on confirm but then at this stage when i was recording this video it took me up to 20 minutes it wasn't going through only then did i realize when i checked the notification on my phone window that it is saying i don't have enough gas you can see that in this screenshot i don't have enough gas so maybe i should have maybe about five cents so that the two cents can easily go through i don't know so I will try later after this video to get some gas and I will try again. But this is basically what you need to do. If you have any questions, do drop me a comment in the comment. And if you have found value in any of my content, do subscribe for more. Like this video so that the algorithm can push it to many others to see it. Thank you for watching and I will see you in another tutorial.